Hey guys, I'm Buddy Velastro here, and this is Fast Cakes, where we make cakes at the speed of life. Today we're making a banana cream roll cake. Banana cream pie was one of my favorite things that my dad made at the bakery. So today we're gonna bring it back and put a new spin on it. So we're gonna start with a chocolate cake mix, whether it's your scratch one, a box mix, whatever you like. So I baked off a sheet of chocolate cake. I baked it on top of a piece of parchment paper, which I greased the pan and stuck down. You want this to be, I'd say, about half an inch thick. Just take a knife or a plastic scraper, run it along my edges just to get my sheet out. So now that we got it down, we're gonna give it a good bada boom. You don't wanna underbake this cake, but you don't wanna overbake it because if it's overbaked, then it's going to crack. So it's gotta be nice, moist, and fluffy, just the like of this. So we have a little bit of custard cream, which I mixed in with a little bit of whipped cream to lighten it up. But you can do the same thing. If you have an instant pudding mix at home and you just add a little bit of whipped cream to it, it'll work just the same. Maybe not taste as good. It's my custard cream in there, but you get the idea. And the first thing I'm going to do is take a little bit of that delicious pudding. And I'm just gonna kind of pop it on there. Bada bing, bada boom. I take my knife, I'm gonna kind of spread it out evenly. You could spread it, you could pipe it, whatever you feel more comfortable with. Just wanna get a nice, even, consistent layer. Smooth out the edges. But now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the regular old banana, nothing fancy. I'm just gonna slice up our bananas until about maybe a quarter of an inch. I'm just gonna kind of line these guys up here. And I'm doing this because it's gonna make it easier to roll. Whenever you're doing a roll, if you have chunks like this, it's a little bit harder to roll. And you notice I have dumped my cake onto two pieces of parchment paper. And what I like to do is use the parchment paper and I'm gonna give it like a little tug. So I'm gonna make sure that the banana is in the cream and stuck. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull tight on the cake and once I got it started you just roll the whole thing up and around just to get it like that so you have a nice beautiful roll there it's nice and tight I'm gonna roll it back up in my paper and now I'm gonna stick this log in a refrigerator to set up a little bit and I'm gonna show you how to finish it off all right so now that our log is set up. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna finish it with some whipped cream. And I'm just going to pipe a little bit of whipped cream on it like this. So now I'm just gonna spread it out with a knife. Okay, so now that I got this all smooth, next thing I'm gonna do is add a couple rosettes. Bada bing, bada boom. I'm gonna take some bananas. I cut it on a 45 just to kind of decorate a little. And I'm just gonna go like this. All right. And my dad always topped it with chocolate crumbs. Just took a little bit of chocolate cake, made chocolate crumbs. Get the other side. This is our banana cream roll cake. I can't wait to taste it. Thanks for watching, and be sure to tell us in the comments what you want to see next. If you want to see one of my other videos, click this link over here. And if you want to subscribe to the page, click the link down there. And thanks for watching. See you next time.